It's that time again. Boxy charm. This is my base box, which has been coming after my premium. Don't care. I love Boxy Charm. It is a subscription. It's a beauty subscription. I shouldn't say makeup because it's it's not just makeup. You get your whole life together with Boxy Charm. So it's makeup, skincare, hair, all that. Um, definitely worth the value. I've been subscribed to Boxy Charm for years now. I recommend it to everybody. Um, treat yourself. Get you get you a boxy charm subscription because it's worth it. All right, first thing um, that stands out to me, I love stuff like this, and I love getting stuff like this from Boxy Charm. This is a green tea detox mask. This looks so bomb. I really, I mean, like, there's no way, there's no way it can't be good. I'm telling you, like the, whew, I can't wait to use this. Um, it's by. Teamy Blends. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right, um, but this retails for $30. Love that. Thank you. There's also a lip scrub. These are cute. This is one, a uh, Bali Bomb. It's a pineapple lip scrub. I will use these, so it's cute to get. I am excited to try this. Oh, lip scrub. Lip scrub is tw was $23. I would never pay that, I'm telling you right now, because e.l.f. has some of the best lip scrubs and they're only $5. Um, I am excited for this. This is a Hydra setting spray for $26. Flawless dewy finish. I am all about that. We are going to use this today. This is another thing I'm going to try today. It's by Wonder Beauty. The Wonderless Escape Palette. Look how pretty. Those colors look amazing. So we're going to dip into her. The uh, setting spray retails for $26. The Wonder Beauty um, Escape Eyeshadow Palette is for $42. And then the last thing in the box. I'm actually really excited because I'm really starting to like this brand. Um, Ace Beauté. They, they, they're they killing it right now. Yes, they are. Yes, this is a um, glow highlighter palette. Glow Essentials Highlighter Palette. Look how stunning. Beautiful. Beautiful. So I'm going to use as much as I can today, which would be the makeup stuff. And then, of course, you know, the detox mask, the lip scrub. The lip scrub I'm not going to do right now. Um, I could, but I'm not. So I'm going to get prepped and primed, and then um, I'll be right back. Okay, we are primed and ready to go for the Wonder Beauty palette. That's so pretty, so pretty. Let's see what we can do. I have an idea of what I want, so I'm like, you know. Let's just go for it. Let's just see how it goes. Grabbing a Luxie brush to start. Luxie 205 Tapered Blending. Love, love, love Luxie brushes. Okay. I'm using the shade Nude Beach. Oh, these names are cute too. Nude Beach to set down a base color. I want to keep it simple, but I want to use that sea glass color. It's screaming my name. Oh. 
I like to do my eyes simultaneously. Um, for me, it's just, I try to get them even as I go. I am not one of those girls that can like do one eye and then come to you and be like, oh yeah, I'm gonna do the same thing over here. Like, that's just not how I operate. Plus I can like keep all my brushes together that I use and like, I don't know, it's just easier for me to kind of go back and forth and get them as even as possible and make the look as even as possible. That's really the goal, right? But man, those girls that can do that, especially with the really detailed work, they are phenomenal. Whew, not on that level yet. The base is cute. How high up do we want to take that? I feel like I always need some more over here. I almost need this is a different type of brush. It is cute. It always looks slightly different on camera, though. Very cute. And then I'm thinking... I'm probably going to use this. I say that. And then same brush. Deepen up the crease with Enchanted. Let's see how this looks. I'm hoping it's more purpley than brown. But... Like the outer two-thirds of my eye. Not all the way to the corner, because from the corner on, I want to do a sea glass. So, let's see if we can just deepen her up. Make this look a little more professional. The uh, shades are really coming together nicely. They're blending really well. Very buttery. Actually, it's looking cute. I keep wanting to switch brushes, but then I stick with this. <laughs> there we go. Sometimes I'm very light handed and I need to learn to like really use product and be more heavy handed honestly. I'm really light handed when it comes to to everything even with moisturizers and I don't know. I need to work on that. Like, How are you going to say it's not working when you're barely using it? Feel me? This is looking really cute, really cute, really cute. Boom, boom. Kind of like buffing the edges on the top without adding product. Diffusing it. Diffusing it. Even though I want more pigment. It just kind of evens everything out. Honestly though. 
let's get into sea glass i just oh, i just can't wait i want to get this base down but oh my god i just want to hop into that color let's see cute cute and then i can always darken up there's another shade in there called overnight i can go back and darken it up later if need be but let's look about the same I usually like them a little thinner than this to do glitter but I really need to clean my brushes and that one's too small so let's try let's try this elf brush it's probably like a concealer brush or something but I'm gonna spray it and use it for this sea glass Can you not? It's cute. It's going all more green. I was hoping it would be more teal, but still cute and actually quite different for me. Let's see where we're at. It's looking cute. I do need some more.
It's really cute. I'm not mad at it. Let's... Can you stop, please? Yo! I do want to try one more color out of the palette as a brow bone highlight. It looks so pretty. And the next time I use this palette, I'm going to use that on my eyes. But just for fun right now. Let's see. It's more like in a corner. This might work. Should I spray it? Let's spray it. Well, oh well, if I diffuse it out, it's a little bit better. That one's going to be way prettier on the eyes. Oh, I forgot we're using a new highlighter palette anyways, but so far, cute. I already have my face done. There is a lot of fallout. I mean, there's really not a lot. But there is definitely some. But we're not complaining. The formulas in here are bomb. Um, anyways, my face is done. So I'm going to use this to finish my eyes and finish my face. And then we're going to use the new setting spray. The Hydra setting spray. Yeah. I 
need to brush this away. Use a little bit of powder and try to sweep this away. It's not that big of a deal. I don't care that much, but you know. Oh well. That ain't going nowhere. Didn't go anywhere. Well, this glitter's going with me today. Cool. All right, we're going to see what icy looks like on the cheeks. I wish I had a di I need a different highlighter brush than the one I'm used to using. But the problem with that is that the best that's the best highlighter brush and that's kind of like my only one. I know there's something else in here I can use. Even though it's uh oh. yeah. We're gonna use the real techniques setting brush for highlighter. See how this looks. I know it's gonna look bomb. I can already see it. Oh, oh. What? Excuse me, ma'am. Hello. Well, hello there. And this color is everything. Wow. I should have just waited and put this under the eyes, but we're still going to put it anyways. Let's do a quick, because I've got a lot of powder on and I should have did this earlier. We need to. Oh, that highlighter. I want more. I want more. This is so good for putting on highlighter. Look at me. Highlighted to the gods. Okay. Whoa. Well, gotta love the mister on that thing. I am very happy with these products. I'm gonna finish up the rest of my face 
and I'll see you guys later.